Moses wrote about Joseph, right? He was Who? not Pharaoh. Wait, 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 wait. He, was, that, uh, he was not. Ramses II was not Pharaoh. I, what, did what? I say Ramses II is not Pharaoh? No, because... You just jumped in. You don't know what's going on. Go, right. Right. Moses see, wrote see the video about later on. Pharaoh. Moses called Pharaoh Pharaoh, right? Yes. That would have been his dad, but a stepfather. Okay. Right? Or That's his adopted not... father. Because Moses was adopted, okay. right, by Pharaoh, by Pharaoh's daughter. All right, agree. By, so by, Pharaoh's, Moses, by right? Pharaoh's wife. Yeah, no, Pharaoh's daughter. We well, believe his wife. Okay, could you? Right, okay, right, right. They Whatever. It, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, okay, right now. Wife, yeah. Right now, huh? it is a matter of you're saying, right? Okay, you believe that so your account you in the wife? Quran sure. is the right interpretation. Yes. Okay, and you have a didactic argument to prove it. Yes. Right. I'll do, I'll do. We are saying, right? Okay, that we we don't believe. That your interpretation is right. No problem. I'm, I'm right? not here. I'm not here. To, listen, where well, you are? No, you just said you're here to win the argument. It, what, you told what, me what, that. Yes, yes. Okay. I'm, I'm saying I already won it. I already did. I already right. did. No, you it's haven't won the argument. You haven't. You haven't. All you've done, all you've done, you done is preach to the converted, because all the Muslims here are going to say, "Oh, my brother is right." Yes, he right? does. I'm, right. I'm right. And I'm right. Say, and not just that. No, 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 no. All we can. Shh. All we Christians are going to say... Don't shush me, don't shush me. I will shush Please, you. Don't, no, I will shush you again. But I, re, but I respect you because you're older than me. Okay. So, so, if, and so versa. the same thing, so don't shush someone. Okay, all right, okay. Right. Will you apologize right. okay. about your shushing me? If you apologize by inter not interrupting me... I didn't interrupt you, you, did. you, you shushed me. You, if no, I interrupt you, you I apologize. No, I have good. no issue. Okay, well, and I apologize for shushing you. Okay, now what do you uh, want to say? Okay, my point is this, right? We can stand here, right, and we can measure our equipment about I'm this and I'm that and the other. But in the end, we all want the truth about God to be revealed. Good. Right? That's what I want. Well, yeah, I'm sure. on a factor, okay? Right? Perfect. Now, now, have you ever dictated a letter? Which letter? You know, you're writing a letter, but somebody's writing it for you. Yeah. Have you dictated a letter? Yeah, I did. Right. Have they ever used their own words in the letter that you've written? You think, hmm. So I've got the impression that's what I said, but they used their words instead of yours. Uh, I will tell you something. I, I know where you're going. No, 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 going. but can you answer my question, please? And then no, I'll no. answer yours. There is no uh, yes and no. Yeah, there, there is. No, 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 no. There's a point I'm trying to get to. No. No, 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 no. Please, please. No, that's not please. yes or no. No, there is. Yes or no. Okay. We all dictate to the letter, right? No, no, no. Hold on. There is well, a point sec, one, to one this. Second, one second. One second. By the way, what's your name? What's your name? My name's Steve. Steve, listen. Steve. Listen to me. Let's agree on something. Okay. Listen, if, if my question to you, yes or no, yeah? Then you tell me maybe if it's not yes or no according to you, you are entitled to answer what, what you think is convenient for you. Yeah? And the same thing goes for me. You cannot dictate me what I should say, what but I shouldn't you're say. You're dictating tacitly. No, no. You, you have I, your people around, you're no, dictating. Listen, listen, no. no but there are Christian people. By the way, by the way, our people around, does that threat you? I mean, we're here. We're here. We are, here, we are, we are being thing. passive. We're being nice to you. And we are, I, I respected you. I apologized okay. earlier. And I respect, I respect yeah? to you too. And, and I apologized earlier if I came and across I in a room. So, so, so I respected again. Yeah. So let's have a respect. We're both passionate people. That's good. Okay. So my point is, what you wanted to say, I want, I understand that what you wanted to say that this Bible, all the on the Old Testament and the New Testament, was written with people's hand and then they will write what they understood it. Correct? Yes. That's what you wanted to say. Yes. My point is, according to their understanding, they can use the term Caesar. They can use any title. Why they specifically use the term Pharaoh for the king of Egypt all the time? That would have been the title of the king in those days. Good. Pharaoh would have been the title Th of the king that's, in those days. I agree with you, but this is, that's yeah. my, my point is, yeah. historical fact is not yeah. something which is, you know, skeptical, it's not something which is, we can skeptic about, we can, it's confirmed. Historical fact, the king at the time of Moses is Pharaoh, I 100%, full stop. full stop. But the king at the time of Joseph, impossible, you understand what it means? It's impossible to use the term Pharaoh, because those the Hexos never believed in Pharaoh. They never believed that they are pharaohs. They are not pharaohs. They will not use the term pharaohs. Okay. Anywhere. So the point is, when Joseph was working for that king, he was co-addressed as a king, not pharaoh at all. all right. At all. Can I ask you this, right? You understand? His lineage, his lineage, his lineage, right, would have been pharaoh. Who? Agreed. In Joseph's time. 
no. Right? Yes, of course he was. No, no. He came a... from a line of pharaohs. No, no, no. That's that, again, he did. That, again, that, again, that's not true. That, that's not true. Go back to history. I'm not, I'm not bringing... Open the history. history. You're saying there's a so stone, in Af right? No. So you got one man... No, 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 not one man. I'm talking about fact, historical fact. I'm not talking about one man. Of one man who listen, listen. with the Bible. What happened? One second. Oh, no, no. No, someone... By the way, he's a Christian. He's a Christian. He's a Christian guy. But I will give... This guy, he didn't interpret anything. What he did, he discovered the old hieroglyphic language into old Greek language, and then and then they start understanding what they used to write on these, on the pyramids and everywhere. Let me try to explain to you. So because at that time, no one knows what is, it, what is written there. They will walk by the pyramids, they will find these scrolls, they don't know what it means. Until this guy, he dismantled the language into the into understandable language, correct? Then, when they brought all these scrolls, all this ancient history, which is written on these, on these minarets, on all, in all, all around Egypt, they said the time of Joseph, around 500 years before Moses was sent, the, the, old, the ancient Egyptian took over, and then they start using the term Pharaoh. Okay. Before that, yeah. during the time of Joseph, yeah. When Hyksos ruled, yeah. impossible the pharaoh was there. So it's okay. not lineage of pharaohs, okay. you I, understand? Can I, right, can I... Can I, can I Do you get the point? I, I, I hear what you're saying. Okay, good. And I respect what you're saying. Good, and I respect but, that but, as well, but, uh, you know. May I say some of what you that say. the Bible, right, in terms of continuity, right, in terms of continuity, use the word pharaoh to describe the type of rule that he had in Joseph's day, because it was Egypt. That's not true. Rather than going to the semantics of language, he used the continuity of language. Okay, right? but that's not Which true. May have Hang on, wait, wait. People still explain whether he's pharaoh or king, he was an eminent ruler. I understand. Carrying on in the traditions, right, of the Egyptians. My, my, the whether he's a hexagon or not, right, in a way, right, is a side issue. No, it's a, it's a main issue. I will tell you why. Just exactly, it's, a, it's not side issue. My point is, what, what I'm trying to get to you and try to make you to understand, all, all, uh, all the Christian fellows or followers of Christianity. Now, when we have, just for example, this country, this very same country, United Kingdom, it was ruled at certain point by Roman Caesars. Yeah, yeah, that's true. At certain point. That's true. Yeah. Like your country's ruled by emirs. Yeah, yeah. And, and then later on, when the when the when the king, the first king, I think, when, when they start coming, when they start uh, having the power of the country, I think what was his name, the first king? I, I forget his name. Anyway. Okay. The you know, from from Henry England. Or, no, uh, not Henry, but not before Henry. Huh? In England, the first king, the one who united um, the kingdom. Oh, oh uh, uh, hang on. Edward? Or? Not Edward. No. It might have been Edward. No, 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 no. Edward. Richard. Huh? Richard. Anyway, yeah, no, it doesn't no. matter. Yeah. So the point is, the point is that there is a first king. So that first king has used the title king, correct? Okay. So the point is, if I am now writing history now, even for example, let's say, let's say Richard the Great. Let's say, yeah, yeah. let's use, let's talk about Richard the Great. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So if I say, and Richard the Great was the pharaoh of the United Kingdom. Right. Okay. Well, someone will laugh at you. So yeah, what, of course what, they what, would. What's this of nonsense? They would. Because, one second, one second. because it's non secretary. Yeah, yeah. So because he, we know Pharaoh is the king of the Egypt at a certain point. Yes. Yeah. And then as well, if you use the Caesar, uh, because Caesar was a title being used here. Okay. By the but, Romans. By the Romans. Yeah. But since he didn't use the title Caesar, he used the title king. So it will be historical error to say about Richard ah, the Great. But, one second. Yeah, sorry, I'm sorry. So, it is historical error to say about Richard the Great to address him as Caesar. It's a historical error. Uh, I hear what yeah, you're you understand. Saying, right? If I find if I find this in a book which claims to be the word of God, not word of man, word of God. And I find this this is the word of God which means it has to be true. And this word of God has historical error. That is what I would be doubting about the facts in okay, this world. Right, okay, you yeah. get it. I understand the thread. If you pull the thread and it all falls apart, that's what you're saying, yes? Yes, that's okay, what I, that's, right. that's and, part and, of and it. And I hear, I hear your didactic argument, all right? But let's come with this. By the way, do you, right? by the way, do you come generally to the park? <laughs> oh, this is the first time. This is the first time, yeah? Yes. Is this the first time? No, I haven't been here for years. Uh, well, uh, you should, you should come more regular. <laughs> we, we all give these hecklers anyway. Right. But, right. Uh, now, let's look at it from this point of view. Right? Pharaoh in Moses' day was his 
adopted father, yes? Okay. okay, so Moses would have used that word as Pharaoh. God, God has used the title Pharaoh. Hold on, wait, 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 because Moses. God also used the personality of the writers good, good. to write also. So, because Moses was an educated man, good, he yeah. went to the Oxford and Cambridge of his time. Yeah, okay. All right, let's use that. Okay? No, not Oxford. No, I, we, we, no <laughs> I, I, let's, we're going to have this. I know. No, no, I'm saying Oxford. <laughs> <laughs> right? Okay. So he went to the Oxford of his time, right? Okay. Therefore, when he wrote, right, as God's secretary, he would have used language that he wanted to put across. So to describe the rule and the way that um, the way that Pharaoh ruled at that time was as a Pharaoh. That right? I, during the time was, I have no problem. With that, it. I, and even in Joseph's time, no. because the guy had absolute autonomy like a pharaoh would. He was worshipped almost as a god, like a pharaoh. Now, the reason why you and I call them pharaohs and not kings, because pharaohs were worshipped as a god-like figure. Okay. Therefore, when Moses wrote that pharaoh, he was saying the type of man this guy was. Okay. Did you finish? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> are you say are you saying any king who no. been worshipped no, has no. to be can use the title no, pharaoh? No, 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 Meaning no, 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 the emperors no. of Japan was no. the pharaohs. So that no, 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 no. So only in terms of Egypt. No. Or Semitic countries. No. You no. Would say. One second. Semitic countries. Okay. That was a Semitic language. Good. Semitic country. <laughs> I, I accept this. Semitic. Let's go back to the Semitic countries. <laughs> Since the Semitic countries, the Canaanites. The Canaanites who ruled, who are Semitic people, one second, they never had pharaohs. They had kings yes. that goes smashing, yes. only smashing Egypt, your... Only Egypt had <laughs> so, <laughs> Only Egypt had pharaohs. Yeah. Well, you know that. Yeah. On. Not only Egypt. Egypt was ruled. Nowadays, for example, there is a president in Egypt. We cannot use his pharaoh okay, feet. You understand? Okay, yeah, Come on. Moses, only pharaohs ruled. Moses. Yes, I agree. But when it comes to Joseph, like to say, is the guy to say, why don't the Bible use the president of Joseph? No, because, because, because this guy was Pharaoh-like. No, it wasn't guy. Pharaoh. wasn't Pharaoh. It was the king. So oh, let's I, use, I understand let's that. Stick, yes. Let's okay. stick to the text. Okay, okay. Yeah. okay. You're saying listen, tomato, listen. I'm saying tomato. Listen, L listen. No, 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 no. It's not tomatoes. We're saying, you're saying tomatoes. I'm saying cucumber. We're, to, we're talking about different things. Different things. By the way. That's one thing. So let's accept. Listen, let's accept something. It is, it is not. I mean, it should be. If if we go to the history, I'm talking about historical facts. It's not something. Well, seriously, if you go now to Egypt, seriously now, and you read all of these scrolls and things. Four. Yeah, you should know. Like Forty years ago. Even forty years ago. No, I don't remember this thing, that. you know, you know, it's sort of no. Because many Christians, they come to us, they say, "Oh, I used to be, a, I used to be Muslim, I converted to Christianity." But I ask this question, which is a trivial question, which is a three, four years old child will answer this question. Yeah. Read Surah Al-Fatiha. Just the Fatiha, the first chapter of the Quran in Arabic. I can't remember. So that's my point is. I will say, I don't know, I doubt that you were Muslim. Okay. Yeah, I, I highly doubt because okay. if you were Muslim, okay. even, even, even one month in your life in Islam, you will memorize Surah yeah, Al-Fatiha. Yeah, but you will child, the Jewish child can quote from six in the Jewish politics. No, not I, Jewish politics, I'm talking about Surah Do you know what Surah Al-Fatiha? 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 What does it mean? Sorry? Do you know what Surah Al-Fatiha? What, where is it? What? Where is Surah Al-Fatiha? I don't know. You see here, that's a, the most trivial question. Even let alone, don't recite it. Where is it in the Quran? I don't, I don't know. You want to know the reason why I don't do that? There is a specific reason why. Because you've never been Muslim. Because that's that's, that's, well, that's what it means. Let, okay. let, let's, let's use this. Listen. Let's say I flirted with it. Okay? Meaning you were not Muslim. <laughs> don't say I was a Muslim. So let's use okay. that. Okay. So you've never been Muslim. I got involved in it. You got involved, but you never was a no. Muslim. Okay, good. Yeah. I, I respect your honesty. Yeah. Now,
yeah. now we are now in one platform. Yeah. So I know many Christians, they just wanted to say, oh, I was a, I was, I was a Muslim. Anyway. No, I know. When these trivial questions, by the way, chapter of is the first chapter of the Quran. Just the, again, the most trivial. <laughs> if you have ever even opened the Quran, you will find it the first one. Thank you. Thank you for that. <laughs> by, by the way, you know the chapter of Fatiha, what it, what it has? Well, I will read it for you and I will translate, yeah, for you. Allah says in the Quran, A'udhu Billah Min Shaitan Rajeem, I seek refuge in Allah from the devil and the whispers of the devil. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim, in the name of Allah, the most gracious, the most merciful. Alhamdulillah Rabbil Alameen, all praise be to Allah, the Lord of the world. Ar-Rahman ar-Rahim, the most gracious, the most merciful. Maliki Yawm al-Deen, the owner of the day of judgment, the day of recompense. Maliki Yawm al-Deen, Iyaka na'budu wa Iyaka nasta'in. It is you and only you we worship, and it is you and only you we seek aid and help. Iyaka na'budu wa Iyaka nasta'in. Ihdina al-Sirat al-Mustaqeen. Guide us to the right path. Guide us to the straight path. So chapter in fact is about asking guidance. اهدنا الصراط المستقيم صراط الذين أنعمت عليهم The path of those whom you have favored صراط الذين أنعمت عليهم غير المغضوب عليهم Neither those who gained the anger of Allah ولا الضالين Nor those who went astray So chapter al-Fatiha It's about seeking guidance from Allah You are wanted the guidance And the guidance in, in, in the meaning In the understanding of Islam Is three things The first guidance that you want God to show you the straight path, the right path. The second is God to lead you to that path, not just only to show you, as well to lead you to that path. The third guidance is God to keep you firm on that path. Okay, can I say something, right? When I became, so beautiful, when by I came to Christ Christianity, right, I had experience with God where the Lord walked into my room and I had a conversation with him. But well, maybe it's the, the devil. It's no, not why the, would it be the devil? Why? I, I, I know the devil. How, how did he look like? Right? I know. I know. I know. It was Jesus. How right? did he, How devil? did he look like? Pure, holy, undefiled. How did he look, look Pure. like? Pure. Features. Features. Shining light. All I saw was a shining light. So you didn't see. I spoke face. to him. He spoke to me. It doesn't matter. No, no. Listen. You can't decry my experience. No, no. I'm not. I'm not well, saying. Yeah. I'm not saying no. I'm saying you. Maybe you had this experience. But for you to know, yeah. That and we believe, we I, believe. I know what you believe in. I believe no. that Jesus Christ is the express image of God. I believe he's the second person of the Trinity. Okay. I believe that he's God, the human being. Okay. Let me ask you a question. Go on. Now, now listen to me. And let's, let us use our own intellectual yeah. ability. Yeah, yeah. Intellect, yeah, right. Just to understand. Don't forget, right, I've been, right, I didn't go to Oxford, right, but I was at LSE in Goldsmiths. So, I would say I'm not doubting. I'm not doubting your intelligence. Good. I'm not doubting at all your so, intelligence. So, so these are not no, no, fabricated. I things. am not doubting your okay. intelligence at all. Yeah. By the way, I, again, I respect you, yeah. and you came in a, in a in a respectful way, and I respect this. Yeah, unlike many of these hacklers who come here <laughs> to the park. So anyway, so the point is, let's let's let, we need to we need to kind of having this the right understanding. Okay. You believe, for example, as a Christian. Jesus is God, correct? Yes, I do. Okay. When Jesus was saying, talking to his Lord. Talking to his Father. Talking to his Father. He was saying, so they will know that you are the only true, true God. True God. Right. If the Father is the only true God, what does that make Jesus? Because the word for God in the Old Testament and it was Elohim. Hmm. Right? Him at the end is plural. Right? So even in Genesis, we see the Godhead. Christ is the exposition of the Word. The Father speaks through the Word, all through the creation through him, and the power of the person of the Holy Spirit. Therefore, we see that God is one, but three persons in one, even as we are made up of a trinity, spirit, soul, and body. Okay, going to answer you. When he says the only true God is the Father, when he is saying this in a clear statement, meaning the son is not God. That's what it means. No, it, doesn't, no, 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 no. it doesn't mean that. Bro. It doesn't mean this. Now, the other thing, what is if we define God? Because, you know, I like, I like, I like academic, you like the academic approach, yeah, approach yeah. and I like the academic approach. Right. Because generally, we might, for example, if I say to you, 
let's define the tree. Yeah. And then we will say different things until we have agreed on certain definition, okay. which is, uh, you know, a creature yeah. that is yeah. a living thing yeah. Yeah. that starts from a seed yeah. and yeah. it grows. And yeah. a, so we'll have a definition. Okay. If yeah. we don't have a definition, we'll be all over the place. Yeah. Correct? I agree. I agree. Yeah. I agree. So let's define, let's define the divine. Okay. What is, what is God? What does God mean? There are three main characteristics which define God's omnipotence. One second. All knowing. Yes. All powerful. Yes. All knowing. Yes. Has independent will. Correct. Yes. Correct. Yes. Does Jesus tick all these boxes? Does what? Does Jesus tick any of these boxes? All of them. Okay. Is Jesus all powerful? Yes. When he was on the cross, he was seeking help from Ah, him. ah. Was he all no, powerful? No, hold no. on. Wait, wait. The, and then let me explain the cross. Right? I know, I know, I know, right. I know what you're going to say. Let me explain the cross, right? Let me explain what Jesus Christ did, right? Now, God saw the fall of man, right? God saw it. God foresaw it. So the Godhead had a discussion. With the who? The Son between themselves. The God. The three persons in one. So they have a discussion. One God, one second. three persons. One second. They have a discussion with who? Yes. God the Son and the Father. You God know, the need... Holy Spirit. God the Father. God the Holy Spirit. God the Son had a discussion amongst themselves. So they debate? N debate, discussion, yes. Well, not debate, though. Did they have a difference of opinion? No. Did they were all in a cold. It was agreed that okay. God the Son would empty himself right of the glory and the honor and the power the shekinah glory he had with the father he would divest himself of it in the power of the holy spirit he would become a human being in his humanity as a human being he became god the man right he will atone for man's sin Okay. Right? He would he would be flogged so badly he's unrecognizable as a human being. He would be crucified on the tree and then God the Father then can pour out his wrath because Jesus then became sin by imputation, not that he was a sinner. Right? He poured out his anger and Jesus would atone for it. When he was buried the old test, the old creation was buried with him. When he rose from the dead, the new creation came into being where he would both be our Lord and Christ. Did you finish? So but basically now. what you mentioned here is clearly stating that Jesus seized his divinity. Correct? Yeah, no, yes and no. No, not yes and no. We no, have we no. He was always God. No, no one second, one he second. was God the man. So, so he was always God. So going back, the he definition. He use his divinity. One second, one second. Let's, let's, uh, let's, uh, let's, let's uh, let, listen, you know, I like, you know, you're an academic person and I respect this. Let's, let's, do, let's use the academic approach, yeah? Okay. So here, Jesus seized his divinity as you, as you claim, which means he's not God anymore. No, when some, no, 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 he did not you, you are interrupting me. as God. You, you interrupted no, me. No, but you're not saying, the, if you're saying the right thing, they're fine. Okay, no problem. I did, I heard you. I no, heard you. didn't cease to be I God. Heard you. I heard you. Okay, fine. I didn't interrupt you. And sorry. I know you're saying. I'm sorry. Sorry. No problem. You're my passion. No problem. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Going back. <laughs> I wish all this discussion here. Why did they bring this? I don't know. <laughs> so anyway. So here. According to what you said, so the 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 those the the, the triune God start de debating, start discussion. Also, shall we do this? And then so oh we can't do that. And then the other one would say, according to you, say you should, they had a discussion, they had a debate. I don't know if it was heated debate or it was or if it was comfortable debate like our debate now. So apparently they have kind of they have kind of disagreement or an agreement or whatever. So that means here that cause contradicts the very nature of God. No. Yeah, yeah. Uh, that's the, the nature no. of God. Wait, wait, one second. If God is all powerful yes, which he is. and all knowing, yes, he is. does he need to have discussion to do things? Yes. No. Yes. Okay. Let even, me tell you. Even, let me tell you something. Prayer. Let even me tell you. Let, let me tell you again. Sorry, let, let me let me tell you. I give you more insight. If I am I am mathematician, yeah. Yep. I'm a mathematician. And I know in the basic math, one yeah. plus one equal to two. Yeah. Correct? 
Now I know one plus one includes two. From my knowledge, do I need to consult everyone in the park here to decide if one plus equal to two or not? Because do God is not like one that. Se one second, one second, one second. Uh, no, I know. I'm not talking about if God likes that or not. I'm talking about let's use our no, own. But, but, but your logic, your logic. See, please, your logic Michael, is Michael, more please, Stephen. Michael. Stephen, <laughs> Stephen, Stephen, sorry. Stephen, uh, because I debated with the, with the mic. So, Stephen, Stephen. Oh, I'll be Michael, go Stephen. On. No worries. <laughs> Stephen. <laughs> Stephen, going back to the point, when I know something, it is true, I don't need to consult about it. Meaning, when the, when the, when the triune God knows it is the true and knows the consequence of the things which he has all knowledge, meaning the possessor of all knowledge, what is before, what is now, what is yet to come, he knows everything. There is no, there is no point of discussion. Can I bring a point? Hang on. You, right? you, you, you interrupted me. No, I hear that, but you're in mid-flow, and I understand where you're going to go with this, right? I am saying, right, that God, plural, right, is a God of relationship. Okay? Right? That's why God is called the Father. He's a God of relationship. Therefore, though he's all-knowing, right, he doesn't always come to us in order he gives us a choice we are not talking about we are not talking about us we're talking about the gods themselves yeah, when they were god. getting to go we're talking yeah, about I'm the gods about according god. to you but i can't let you devalue you no know, well, one second i'm not devaluing i'm not devaluing jesus we value jesus peace be upon him we value him that he is a prophet and of god but my point is here this is the point look at the, look at this understanding and then you will get you get what i'm saying my point is when you mentioned when they were debating and having this discussion if it's something that is known According to God, there is no point for the discussion because it's known. He knows what's happening. But when there is discussion, that means apparently they don't know about what's going to happen, firstly. Secondly, that's what, by the basically, you shot yourself in the foot with, with, this, with this analogy. Like the, other thing, the other thing, when it comes to the point, when we talk about, okay, Jesus sees his glory, meaning he sees his divinity, that according, he become not God now anymore. He became as a form of human being, as you said. So he's not God. So when he is not God here, that means he seized his divinity. That means he's not God. When you say to him, he, if he was God, in the same time he was a man, in the same time, which is the Christian doctrine, they say he is fully God and fully man in yeah, the same time. Yeah. If he is fully God and yeah. fully man in the same time, yeah. as a fully God, is he, if, if someone does, is the fully God ha, have position, the, is he all knowing the fully God? Yes, God is all-knowing, as you mentioned. Now, Jesus was asked a very simple question for God. And the God will answer this question. People came to Jesus and asked this, asked this question to Jesus. When is the hour? And that defines God, because the only one knows about the hour is the God. It's simple the as that. One second. The Father. Yeah. The Father. Then carry on. Right. Ne neither. Right. Neither. The, the angels. Ne no, neither the Son. Yeah. No, the right. angel. But no one yes, knows no, on, about... You're taking that out of context. No, no, no. no, no. Jesus, Jesus took it out of context. in his Not humanity. Me. No, no, no. Let me explain. Jesus in his in humanity was limited. He came to do one thing. That was to redeem mankind. He okay. came to die. All right. Right? Therefore, Until you finish, I will answer. Therefore, yes. and I remember I said to you in the beginning, which you've forgotten, Jesus emptied himself. Became right. no God. Right now, listen. Right? Was he God? Right, listen, listen, listen. When you talk to your two-year-old son, right? Do you talk to your two-year-old son with all the knowledge that you know? No. Right, exactly. So Jesus came down to our level and spoke in our level. You shot yourself with the other foot. Well, no, 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 no. I haven't. I tell you. You'll have no why. foot to shoot no, now. No, no, listen, listen. <laughs> now let me finish explaining what I'm saying. Yeah. Right. In order for Jesus to redeem humanity, he had to live as a human being so that at the resurrection, we inherit his humanity. Okay, did you finish? That was no, I've not. Okay, finish. I've not. So, I'm gonna go over it one more time. No, no, do it. Jesus Christ. You right? have you have two foot, you okay, shot yourself right, now. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Jesus Christ, right, is God. He agreed the Father that the Father would become the emblem of authority. He would become totally human in the power of the Holy Spirit. He would fulfill the, the law, the Ten Commandments, completely. He would complete the law. 
on the cross he would pay the price for man's sin right then when he was buried man's sin was buried with him when he rose from the dead as a man the new creation rose with him when he ascended he then trained the church for 40 days when he was glorified he was glorified as lord and he regains everything he sacrificed so he becomes fully god again but in his humanity did you finish i finished okay good let's let's go back to the foot that you shot yourself <laughs> let's go back to the number here yeah, you said you said that's a good a good analogy by the way can you talk to your five years old child the way that you think that shows jesus at that time was he fully god 100 percent god yes so if he was 100 percent god how do you how dare you you are saying about him that he was like like a five years old one the point is what the, you give me this analogy no, the point is that you're shows <laughs> you said can you talk no, to you about brother, brother brother you're saying i'm using an analogy good meaning he wasn't fully god he so that's why god. listen you, you already said you already said one second if he was fully god firstly he did when he said when he said no one knows about dawa except the father neither the son nor the angels it's, oh, no one knows, and he confirmed. No one knows. He confirmed twice. No one knows about that except the Father. So the point is, when Jesus said, Jesus didn't say, "Oh, the God Son." Oh, he didn't say, for example, the human nature of the Son doesn't know about the hour, but the, the God nature of the Son knows about. It. He didn't say that. He said, "The Son, the Son, the whole Son." This son doesn't know about Dawa. You're presuming. Yeah, not presuming. You this are, is presuming. this is statement. You've got no proof of what you say. Now one second. I go to hear what he said. No, no, you got no proof. You see, you interrupted me, by the way. Yeah, I didn't interrupt you. you did I was respectful. I know you're right. You answer you heard. Me. Okay, good. Oh, okay. So, so the point is, Jesus, when he was, he said, no one knows about Dawa. No one knows about that except the Father. Neither the Son. That the Son mean. The sun God, the sun man, the, the sun doesn't know about Dawa, nor the angels knows about Dawa. The only one knows about Dawa is the Father. Now, either Jesus was lying, if he knows about Dawa, why did he hide this knowledge? If he knows about Dawa, why did he, why did he lie to the people? If his God side knows about Dawa, why the God side didn't interrupt and spoke? That's one thing. Again, if Jesus is all knowing, he's apparently that shows he's ignorant about certain things. If he is not powerful, he couldn't defend himself. He was even, think about it. He was think, asking, asking the father to help him, to help him when he was on the He was asking, begging, why have you forsaken me? Can you imagine? If the other thing, the other thing, if he was, if he knew he was meant to be sacrificed, why did he ask? Because He's, he said it as a human being. No, he, no there is no, if he is 100% God, According to you, if he is 100% God, will not say this because because he knows that's his. He was, for example, if, if I create, for example, for example, let's say this watch, I, for example, this watch was created for certain purposes. Yeah, okay, yeah. you you cannot use it to drive a car. You cannot put it. You cannot. Yeah, thank you. Anyway. <laughs> okay. So the point is, the point is, it is meant for something. It is meant. This machine is meant for this purpose. If Jesus was so clever, yeah. Yeah, according to you, he knew his purpose is to do this. Yeah. He has one single duty to die on the cross, according to you. <laughs> and this single duty, the night before, he was saying, you know, take this cup away from me. He was, he was it's asking. Possible. Yeah, he, he, he doesn't want, he doesn't want the sacrifice. He is no, asking. Uh, uh, he's scared. He was sweating human, blood. Okay, can I, you know, can I say why? Listen, listen, right? listen, listen. He I, had I, been separated from the father before. One second, one second. He was about to become somebody very thing he hated. <laughs> you, said, you said we had no, no, discussion. He was God the man. Listen, listen. Steve, okay. they were had a discussion okay. just a minute right. ago. Okay. When they had a discussion, they were already no, no, separate. I know, I know, I know. But in a way, Steve, let's, let's go back I to the point. Right? So he was sweating, he was terrified, he was scared, he was saying, Oh, take this cup away from my, from me. If it's possible. One second. And what he said, here we said if the if if he's, if he's God, he, he will have an independent will. What he said, Jesus? Let it be not my will. Let it be not my will, but yours. Now, does Jesus have independent will according to this? Yes. 
He doesn't have. He said, he "Listen, what he said." He could have chosen. No, not no. To. He no. He the very fact he said father. He can. Cho uh, he can could have chose not does to he have go. a choice? Does he have a choice? No. He can. Yes. He does have a. choice. He has a choice. Yes. Can you imagine? You know, think about it. No, no, hang on. Th think See, about no, it. No, no, wait, wait, wait. Think about no, it. To turn your logic around, right? If I'm saying to you, if I'm saying, right, you're saying to me, right, that Steve, I want you to go and buy that tree, right? And I'm saying to you, and you're my dad, right? And I'm saying to you, I, I'm your son. Why did you I say? Ha ha ha! You're my dad, right? Okay, and I'm no problem. To you, son, go buy that tree. Dad, I want to use this money for something else, right? Okay. But dad, if you want me to use this money to buy that tree, I'll go and buy it. Do you have independent will? Is that yes. what? No, you mean I have no choice. Otherwise, we don't come home. I respect you enough. To, set, to, What's to, to buy the tree because you asked me to. Listen to me. If Jesus went to, I will tell you something. What is my, can you imagine? Can you imagine? God, you know. God, God has created the sun for a purpose, yeah? For a purpose. To give, to get, to shine and to, you know, to spread the, the light on earth, etc. Yeah? So that has a purpose. So can you imagine? It, so it is, has one single purpose. Jesus, who is more important than the sun, who is more important as a human being and as a prophet of God, he knows, according to you, he knows he has one single mission, one single purpose, which is to die on the cross. Does he have a choice? No, he has he no choice. But he said, let it be not my will. He's, firstly, <laughs> one second. He said, take this cup away from me. Ask him, if possible. He doesn't want to do it. And then he is saying after that, let it be not my will, but, but yours. Will but die over there. So he doesn't have independent will. And listen, Steve, please, Steve. Wallahi, by Allah, I'm saying to you, you, are, you seem a genuine person. And I'm, these things, doesn't, Jesus doesn't take any of these boxes. He is, he is not all powerful. He was crying. He was crying. You know, why have you forsaken me? By the way, when he was on the cross, he was asking, he was begging. He was saying, why have you forsaken me? Yeah? When he was on the cross, what did he say? He forgave people on the cross. Yeah, when he was on the, yeah, he forgave. When, what he said, the last is word, last one. Right. When, 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 you see, Elohim, because, Elohim, on, on, Elohim, wait, 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 Elohim, 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 300 years ago, it says, curse is everyone that hangeth on the tree. In the, in the, for the prophet Isaiah. When Jesus hung on that cross, he took the curse. He took the of curse. Humanity. Therefore, so he's the cursed. first part of the curse was to identify with sin. Right? The second part of the curse was then when he paid the price, right? When he paid the price, he said it is finished. Okay. Right? Before that, what did he God say? God ripped the curtain from top before, to bottom before, before. and man was redeemed. Before, before, what did he say? No, but you see, you have to take it sequentially. No, before the, the first thing, what did no, he say? No, 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 the first thing he said, right? Steve, what did he My say? My God, why has thou forsaken me? Good. When he identified My with God. sin. My God. My God. My God, why have you forsaken yes. me? Yes. My God. Yes. Who forsaken who? Right. He said, who, right. Who forsaken who? Right. The father... Who for a second? God the Father for a second. poured out his anger on Jesus our rep because Jesus is known as the second Adam. That's not my point. No, 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 that is a point. Okay. Right? If we believe that all of us came from the first Adam, then Jesus is the second Adam. Okay. Did you finish? Yeah. My point is going back to ask you. When Jesus is saying, Why have you forsaken me? Who's forsaken who? Right. God, 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 my God, my God, my God, my why have Jesus Christ. So, so, so the so the God forsaken Jesus. Yes. So you forsaken. At that time. Him. So you forsaken. At that time. At that time. One second. One second. Do you see? Do you understand? That's another foot you shot yourself with. No, no, <laughs> but I'm not. You see, you have to understand listen, redemption. Listen, I will tell you something. Now listen to me. And if God is all powerful, have yep. possession of all power. Yep. Just we need to repent to him and he will accept our repentance. Simple do as you know, that. Do you know what a height of Sim power simple is? Simple as that. Do you know what a height of power is? To be weak. Yeah, but to be weak. Have you never what read kind of nonsense? God's weakness is more stronger no. than the strength of men. Have you never read no. that the gospel is perverse to those who don't believe? That's, that's nonsense. Have you never read, right? That's so nonsense, Piper. God's power, as it said in scripture, right, is more powerful than the strength of men. Okay. 
steep and, and think careful about what, I say, what I'm saying here. <laughs> you see here, Jesus firstly, when he said, God, oh my God, why have you forsaken? Meaning he is not God. My God. He has a God asking him and he said, is and this God, one second, one second, one second. He didn't say he's a human. He is hundred. He when was he a human was, being when he died on the cross, bro. Was he hundred percent God? Yes. On the cross. But he was hundred percent human as well. But was he hundred percent God? Yeah. Look, do you not realize, right? It's just so now. That's right, another foot you should do yourself right, with. The part but of him that was you will have. I don't know how you walk. Was caught. He said, "It's yours. I commit my spirit." Oh. Right. Right. Listen, then listen. Jesus then on his soul was poured out as a soul offering. On his body, he bore them out for sin. Okay. You have to realize okay. that on the cross of Jesus Christ, right, three things happened. Right? You don't understand. And what we can are they? This tell all me. Day. Tell right. me. Okay. One. one come, brother. Come, brother. You know. One. <laughs> where are you? One. By the way, where are you Christian before? Yeah? Are you revert, brother? Yeah? No, right. He went through this before you. <laughs> okay, alright. I love those brothers. <laughs> right. are, are you Jamaican, by the way? Are you Jamaican? No. Where are you from? I'm from the West Indies, Barbados. Barbados? Yeah. So, yeah. Uh, close no, to that I'm area. I born here in Blighty, though. <laughs> right. I know, no problem. I work my okay. Way. Right? But, what we're going to say is, right, with the person of the Lord Jesus Christ, right, when he paid the penalty for sin, he identified totally with humanity as a second Adam, right? Therefore, in his identity, when God forsook him, he paid the penalty for sin. Listen, listen, Steve, about, about him being the second Adam, because God has mentioned in the Quran, by the way, for you to know, God has mentioned in the Quran, Adam around 25 times, and mentioned Jesus in the Quran 25 times, and God has mentioned the example of Jesus like the example of Adam. Allah has created him. Allah said, be, and he became in miraculous birth. So that's, that's the meaning of the second Adam with this. But going back to the point, Jesus first he never claimed to be God. Never himself claimed to be God as a God, to be worshipped. Yeah? God, no, he didn't. He did. Well, he did. In the Bible, he claimed to be God. Well, he he never, never claimed to be he God. He said, me and the Father are one. Are one, again, read the, read the context. Read the context. People, the children of Israel, the, the Jews, they came to him. They were asking him about rules, he about said, certain... Abraham, what, what, one second, one second, one second. Okay. One second, I am what? Ambiguous. Uh, so, going back to the point. So they were saying to him about certain things. Certain, again, laws, because the, the sister, or the one who was asking about the Sharia laws, they were about laws. He said about the laws. They're talking about laws. Yeah? And then they were saying to him, are you... And Jesus started saying to them certain laws. And then they said to him, why do you need to follow these laws? And they said, me and the father are one in terms of legislation. That's what it means. Try to understand it in a context. Don't take things out of context. That's first thing. I would say the same thing for you. Yeah, I don't take it out of context. Yeah, yeah, yeah when you read it, context. when you read it then, no, you know, no, the, you the last question, that. the last question to you, Steve, okay. which is you are an academic person and I admire this. Okay. If I'm writing an article, yeah, yeah and I'm using a reference, yeah, yeah I will bring the author, yeah of this article, and I will bring where it's printed, etc. Yeah? So, I, I will ask you this question. We have the Gospels mentioned in the Bible, yeah. and we have the Gospels of John, correct? Yeah. Who's John? Who's John? John was one of the disciples. Who said so? No. He said it was. No. He did you know, you know the beginning of the Gospel, what it says? You know what it says? It says, and this book is according to John. English is not my first language. Correct me if I'm wrong. Correct me. You, your English is first language. Yeah? Yeah? When I say this book according to Steve, according, according to Steve, does it mean you wrote it or does it mean I copied it from what you said to me? No, no. Listen, Steve, you know, let's use, we are using English here. Yeah? This book is according, is, is according to John. Yeah? And when I'm, I, English, English is not my first language, I, but I understand English. When I say according to, it means I'm copying it from someone, correct? Listen, listen, no, 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 Steve, no, no, Steve, no, no. listen, Steve, we can Google that, by the way, if you want, if you want. Yeah, yeah, we can Google that. Just Google and you'll find that. This is the story. This is the story. It's my, it's my no, 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 no. I'm saying. No, no, no. He could say, this book is according to what no, I say. According to you, one second. Right? according to you, one second. Right? Steve, Jesus Steve. is not the second. No, 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 one second, one second. I will tell you something. I will tell you something. The point is, Steve, 
when I'm saying according to someone, meaning there is a third person. You understand? That's what it means. You're translating what so there is, said. you are, you're translating or you're saying what this person has said. So that's a third person. I'm not talking about this third person. That's not my point. That's that's even though it's a problem itself. But even if John dictates it, it one second, one second. John, yeah, yeah, a yeah. Word, yeah. Let's use this. Even that, who's John? John's his disciple. Who said? He said. How can you be sure? If the, can yeah, you imagine? I'm sure he's not. No, he's not. He is not. No, you're taking that to be. No, no. I word. believe it, right? Yeah. I okay. don't have to prove it. No, no you can't believe. You can't believe there's dragon flying. Yeah, I know, but so can yeah, you. Yeah, yeah. So you can, it doesn't matter how much I believe. <laughs> uh, listen, listen, Steve, Steve. We have to be. We have to think logical. For example, yeah, this. Listen, listen. Yeah, in this dogs. country, in this country. Yeah. By the way, until some people still still believe there used to be dragon know, flying around. Yeah. One forensic second. facts. Yeah. We have to be forensic. Okay, good. I know where you're going. My point Don't is, who is John? <laughs> John was a disciple. Jesus who said? Loved. Who said? John did. Where is it? Where? If you read the epistle. No, no. Where? Okay. Show me. Show me. Where John I said here? No, no, no. We know. He never said that I'm John the disciple. Do you know that? Even Luke. I will tell you that. Listen. Luke you know, only speaks from um, from Paul. By from, the way. From yeah. Mark, yeah, yeah, yeah from from and I will tell you, John copied from Mark. Yeah. No, yes. the other way round. Yeah. The other way round. No, 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 from Mark. No, the other way round. From, from Mark. The other way round. Mark copied from John. Okay, it still makes, makes it worse even. <laughs> because look, because look, because look, copied from Mark. the Holy Spirit is the author. <laughs> one second, one second. No, 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 that's nonsense. No, 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 no. Is the Holy Spirit author? Yeah, there's contradictions. One second. No, no, there's not contradictions. Steve, Steve, Steve. No, listen, 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 uh, <laughs> Let me finish. No, 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 no. Listen, right? If yeah. you and I saw a car crash, yeah. right? Yeah. Right, you and I saw a car crash, Not, right? No, you saw the car crash. <laughs> and I copied from you. No, and no, he copied no. from me. And you saw the car <laughs> crash. <laughs> and you saw the car crash as well, right? Listen. Right? Listen, <laughs> whisper. Listen. listen. Whisper to me one word. And I will say to him in my word. He will say to him, and then we'll get nowhere. I'm not doing Chinese whispers to you. You see him. <laughs> listen. Listen, we're going to come down Listen, to debate Steve, again. Steve, yeah? Steve, yeah, yeah. I will tell you the last thing. Yeah, You see yeah. here, by the way, even the biblical scholars, they said, no one knows who's John. Right. They even, they came to five names. They said, they could be, even they said, maybe the John the Baptist, and then some of them, they say he's not, you know, by the way. He can't be. And then they said, they don't know who's John. No one knows who's John. He is John the unknown. That's John. He is John, the ambiguous John. Uh, no one knows who's John. I don't believe that. Listen, I'm mean, seriously, listen. Listen, 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 wallahi, I'm not lying to you. No, Please. no, I know you're not lying. Yeah, right? I'm not lying. I, 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 read, I read what no, the... I what hear the, you. Yeah, no, okay. I know, I know you're so the point is, no one knows who's John, and no one knows who wrote from John, let alone all of these days. Uh, and then they said John, John copied from Mark, yeah. and then... It's Max, you see, uh, okay. we are in this loop. Listen, when I come down again, we debate again, right? Okay. Let's debate who's John. Uh, yeah, we'll do that, definitely. Who is John, the unknown? Right. Right. We need to know. And I'll say he's not unknown. He is unknown. By the way, tell me his, his father's name. Who's he? <laughs> People used to be known with their names. Yeah, yeah, Listen, yeah, what's the name of Jesus? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jesus? Jesus, the son of the God, according to you, yeah. that he has a long lineage. The son of Joseph, all the way. Do you know Christ? <laughs> even the lineages are different right, right. in the Bible. Do, when you read the Bible, no, you read do you know Christ? It was his, his, um, his title, not his name. So, so his name was the his son of Jesus Joseph. The Christ. Okay, the son. You know the beginning, the first chapter. You know the yeah, son of Joseph and all. Of, son of. All, all. So they, it was known to know the son of who? Who's John? The right. son of who? He came from the lineages of Joseph and Mary. But we'll talk about this grandpa. again, yeah. No one knows about John. No, so no. the point is, <laughs> listen, you base your salvation, this contradiction and all of these things. And again, see, well, again, I ask Allah, yeah. the one God. Okay. By right. the way, Allah means the one God, by the way. Okay. They, think, they say the, it's I the one God. I, I ask Allah to guide you to the right path. And today, today, you know, you know the first chapter of the Quran, when you go home today, please, do you, do you have a Quran? Do you have a Quran? Do you want me to give you one? No. Let me no. give you one, just no, to read it. No, no. Are you sure? Yeah, I've got one. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Just read the first chapter of the Quran and sincerely ask Allah, ask the God to guide you. Uh, I, I, no, I'll tell you this Ask now. him no, no, to no, guide no, no, you. No. Right. I could say this to placate you, right? But I'm not going to do that. You want to know why, right? Because I believe, right, that in the scripture, I believe in what I said. I believe that I know what the truth is. 
Right, OK. So I, I could lie to you, but I'm not if, going if to. The truth, if the truth... Not listen, if you yeah, think... There's a different... I just want to say one thing. No, you know but Jesus. that's not true, though. Yeah, one second, one second. I'm even saying, you know Jesus, yeah? His grandfather is actually debated who it was, no, the father of Joseph. No. And I've got, I've got proof yeah, here Yeah, I know, well. you go. We'll debate it later on, because right now I'm very tired. Yeah, yeah, I know. You're very tired. Yeah. Do you need water or something? Or... No, I've got some. You sure? Yeah. Yeah, there's someone who could get you water. We don't want you to go. Yeah. By the way, it was nice having discussion with you. I respect, I respect you. Yeah. And I ask Allah sincerely to guide you to the right path. Okay. And sincerely, think about it. That all these contradictions, all these things, let it, you know, think about it. Maybe there is, a, maybe what you saw, this light, what you saw according to you. Maybe, by the way, God cannot imitate his creation. And the light is a creation of God, by the way. We'll talk about it again. Oh, no. the, the mic of the brothers. By the way, thank you, anyway. Look after yourself. And I love it. Take all right. Care. Take care. All right. Anyway, it was... You know, uh, I ask Allah to guide to guide him, and, I, and this is one of the rare times in this, you know, uh, in the park that to find people are genuinely discussing and have this kind of a, a nice nature of discussion. I ask Allah to guide him and to bring him to the path, and please, as well, my brothers and sisters, make du'a for him. He is he genuinely wanted to find the truth. Inshallah, he will find the truth. Inshallah, I ask Allah to guide him. Zakum Allah khair. Salam alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.